Nothing's gonna make you fall from heaven Girl, I just wanna love you Don't listen to what people say They don't know about, about you and me Put it out your mind, cause it's jealousy They don't know what I'm missing Don't listen to what people say They don't know about you and me, put it out your mind, cause it's jealousy, they don't know what I'm missing. What's up folks? <laughs> Little John B on the ride home from the splash pad and Arby's doing our thing. Happy early Father's Day to all the fathers out there. We salute you. We doing our thing over here. Mm. Had an interesting past couple of days at the splash pad positive stuff when I can talk about autism so yay I love that yesterday when we splashed when we got done these two little it was like a, a hood birthday party they was playing Petey Pablo and ODB with the explicit lyrics for damn five year old kids playing and shit that was awesome <laughs> but uh, when we got done we was drying off this little boy just runs up to me and goes, does he have autism? I said, yes. And he was like, why? And I was like, well, he was born that way. Then he looks at me and goes, your chest is bleeding. And I looked down, I was like, oh, I got a red birthmark on my chest. I was like, it's a birthmark. And he was like, why? I was like, I was born that way too. And it was just real sweet. Then his, uh, a little brother, his older brother came and was like, does he have autism? And I was like, yep. And he was like, my other brother has autism too. So that was kind of real sweet. Those kids just came and engaged and it was real cool. And I noticed when they was playing with Aiden in the splash pad, you know, they, they engaged him as well. Not They wasn't overbearing or anything, but you know, they it was cool. It was like a parallel play kind of deal. So uh, hats off to those kids and those kids' parents because they were they were raising them right. That was real sweet. Then today at the splash pad, there was this little boy. He was like three years old. I saw him stemming. You know, everybody stems differently, but he was doing the traditional jumping up and down, hands flapping kind of deal. He was pushing on other kids twice his size. He's running to him, just pushing in the back like. Whoosh. And dad was like, hey, 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 you know. Dad was watching him like a hawk, like I do. If you're an autism parent, you know what to do. And then, you know, I went over there, I spoke to him. I was like, hey, is that your son? He was like, yeah. I was like, can he talk? He was like, nah, he's not verbal. I was like, it's all right, man, mine is too. I was like, I saw how your kid moves. My kid moves in a similar way. So we got to chatting a little bit, you know, talking about therapy and stuff. And I, you know, talked to him about the iPad because Aiden uses his iPad to talk when he wants to go to a certain place and get something to eat. <clears throat> so we chatted a few minutes and that was just real cool. I like to try. And you know, I'm in public, I'm not, I'm kind of not very social or, you know, I'm kind of shy. And uh, so it takes a lot for me to come up to speak to a stranger, you know what I'm saying? But I feel compelled to do it and to let them know, hey, you know, they're not alone. It's a camaraderie kind of deal, you know what I'm saying? So I hope to see the guy again. The dude was like, hey, you come here all the time? I was like, yeah, about every day. <laughs> he was like, damn. I was like, yep. So we'll see. I just thought that was real sweet. Aiden, say hey. Now you didn't see, but I felt his hand go up and down. He waved. <laughs> so uh, let's see. That's about it. Oh, Nick Jenkins. I did your challenge. I'm gonna post it on Monday. The 100 lunges. I did it in, I did 110 by accident. And when I timed it and everything, it was 110 in eight minutes. But uh, I had the bright idea of doing it at the splash pad barefoot. So the, the balls of my feet are raw. They're not blistered. They were close. It was close to blister and breaking the skin. The skin didn't break, but they all red on the bottom. I'm like, damn. Like, I was 
walking very gingerly <laughs> last night. But it was a good challenge, and I thank you for that. So I'll tag you and everything when I do it. But anyway, folks, everybody go eat. Hope y'all have a good one. Fathers, have a happy Father's Day. Order grandfathers. Y'all take it easy. Peace.